Hi, I'm Julie from the American Crochet Association. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the simple wave stitch. For this tutorial, I'll be using Red Heart Creme de la Creme in the colors Wood Violet, Gray, and Aqua. I'll also be using my Water Lilies hook from Happy Crochet Hooks in a size H, 5mm. We'll start out with a slip knot. The stitch is worked in multiples of 12 plus 5. For this example, I'm going to start out by chaining 29. To start the first row, we'll make one double crochet in the fourth chain from the hook. The previous three chains will count as your first double crochet. Now we'll skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. And then one more time, skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. Now we'll make one double crochet in the next chain. And now five double crochets in the next chain. And now we'll make one double crochet in each of the next two chains. And now we'll skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. We're going to do this four times total, so now skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. Skip one chain and double crochet in the next chain. And one more time, skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. And now we'll make one double crochet in the next chain. And now five double crochets in the next chain. And now we'll make one double crochet in each of the next two chains. And now skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. And then one more time, skip one chain and make one double crochet in the next chain. And we'll finish the row by making one double crochet in the final chain and finish by changing colors.
To start row two, chain one with your new color. This will count as your first single crochet. And then turn your work over. Now we'll make one single crochet in each stitch all the way across. And now we'll finish the last stitch by changing to a new color. To start row three, chain three. This will count as your first double crochet. And turn your work over. And now we'll make one double crochet in the next stitch. And now skip one stitch and make one double crochet in the next stitch. And then one more time, skip one stitch and make one double crochet in the next stitch. And then one double crochet in the next stitch. And now we'll make five double crochets in the next stitch. And now we'll make one double crochet in each of the next two stitches. And then skip one stitch and make one double crochet in the next stitch. We're gonna do this a total of four times. So now skip one stitch and make one double crochet in the next stitch. And skip one stitch and one double crochet in the next stitch. And one more time, skip one stitch and one double crochet in the next stitch. And now we'll make one double crochet in the next stitch. And now we'll make five double crochets in the next stitch. And now we'll make one double crochet in each of the next two stitches. And now skip one stitch and make one double crochet in the next stitch. And one more time, skip one stitch and make one double crochet in the next stitch. And we'll finish the row by making one double crochet in the last stitch and finish by changing colors.
To continue working this stitch, just repeat rows 2 and 3 as many times as you'd like, changing colors at the end of every row. 